Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I'm back with the upboard and I want to see if we can run World of Warcraft. This is a Raspberry Pi sized Windows 10 Android and Linux single board computer. Pretty cool. I mean, it's definitely more powerful than the Raspberry Pi. We can run Windows 10, Linux, and Android on it. it has an Atom X5 Z8350 CPU clocked in at 1.4 gigahertz. This model has 4 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM running at 1600 megahertz and 32 gigabytes of onboard eMMC storage. I'll leave links in the description to my initial unboxing and a run of Crisis on this thing. Let's get into it and try World of Warcraft. Before we get started, I want to warn you that I do not play World of Warcraft. I suck. I'm a level 1. And that's where this thing will probably slow down the most when there's tons of people around battling with lots of particle effects. But we can get a feel for it. Let's start it up and see what happens. I am running an active cooler on this unit just to keep the temps down. Looks like this. Okay, so I got the game booted up. Let's see how it does here. First, let's go to my menu and I'll show you what settings I am using. We're at 1080p. Everything's on low. We have to be this thing has an Intel HD GPU. It's a Intel HD 400 at 500 megahertz with 512 megabytes of RAM. Okay, so if you look under my character right here, I have the FPS listed. We're in a very basic spot right now. There's not a lot going on, so you can expect this to drop even more when you get into battle. When there's tons of sprites on screen and lots of particle effects going on, so yeah, performance is pretty crappy with this. Yeah, this is going to be pretty unplayable at, I mean, this thing's going to drop on down to like 5 FPS when we get into battle. Now, I'm not going to be able to get into battle here with lots of particle effects. As you see, uh, I'm running into a fence. I really don't even know how to play the game. No, but for real, um, I'm only level 1, so... Let's go down with the settings. Really, the only thing we can do is drop the resolution to increase performance now. We'll go to 1280 by 720. So we up the frame rate to close to 30 FPS. Really not that bad. Still, it's going to lag when you get into battle. Let's go kill some orcs or whatever they're called. Something here. Now, I did try to play this game a long time ago. I think I got to like level 5 and I just I couldn't get into it. I used to play Warcraft. Um... Real Warcraft, not this MMMMO stuff. I guess that's what it's called. It's really not that bad, though. You could definitely get away playing this um, on, on the upboard. I never got a chance to try this on the Latte Panda. I am going to try it, but the thing was, I could never get this downloaded. It always gave me an error when I was trying to download it. This is running from an external USB 3.0, 60 gigabyte SSD. And I really wanted to get this test out of the way just to uh, free up some space on my SSD so we can do some emulation testing and other stuff like that. I'm going to go try to find a spot where there are more sprites located, people moving around a little bit, just to get a feel for what the FPS will look like in a town or something like that. And I literally, I don't have time to play this game till I can get to like a higher level and go into a town and test this out. I mean, I could make time for it, but really, I, I don't want to. That's what it boils down to. So yeah, I mean, even with all these guys around here, I did see some, like, knights running around over here. We're going to go, oh, did I finish my little quest? Heck no. Still got some spies to kill. I got to kill one more of those. Let's do that and then see what else he offers up. It's probably going to be go and pick some berries or some freaking wildflowers to make a healing potion or something. Complete my quest. Except. So I gotta go talk to this dude. Are you around back here? 
I mean, that's pretty much it, guys. 30 FPS. I have to say that this would probably drop down to 15 FPS, even at this resolution, with a lot of stuff going on on screen. Um, I've seen videos online where there's like 50 people fighting a giant monster creature, like Leroy Jenkins style. And uh, yeah, with this GPU and CPU combination on this board, I mean, you could definitely get away with playing the game. For me, it wouldn't be too enjoyable at a 15 FPS, you know, frame rate. But if this is all you got, you can definitely do it. And we could go down a bit more. Let's do that just to see. The lowest we can go is 720 by 576. That's a weird resolution. And this is starting to look like RuneScape at this uh, resolution here. My FPS is now missing on screen. There we go. 41. 40 FPS. Yeah, you could definitely play it here. Overall, the upboard does run World of Warcraft. It doesn't run it very well, but if you lower the resolution on down, you can get up to the 30, 40 FPS range, which would definitely be playable. I really appreciate you guys watching. If you could, hit that like button and subscribe. I got a lot more coming. If you want to see anything else running on this upboard, let me know in the comments below. I'll try to get a video made this week. I'll try to get a video made this weekend. And like always, thanks for watching, guys.